Hi guys, magandang gabi. So, another day has gone. So, thankful tayo. We're blessed na meron tayong sales, meron tayong business. And ito, I just like to give you an actual report na natanggap ko for today. Isa, isa ito sa mga branches na um, laundry business natin. And ito maganda para meron kayong idea on a daily basis, magkano nga ba talaga ang kinikita ng isang laundry shop? So, kung curious ka, I hope magustuhan mo tong video na to. And medyo gabi na, late na, and this is yung routine ko. At the end of the day, I really make sure pagdala ng mga sales report from different branches, iti-check ko kagad para the following day, I have a better idea kung ano yung magiging takbo ng isang branch natin. And this one, we're looking at yung sales for April 4 today, right? So sabi dito, nagkaroon tayo ng sa dalawa, tatlo, apat, lima, anim for today. Six customers totaling with 2,600 sales. So ano-ano nga ba yung uh, breakdown ng sales natin? Let's look at them one by one para meron ka talagang idea Ano yung mga sales? Or paano nga ba bumibenta yung isang laundry shop? Alright, so first customer natin, si Ma'am Trisha. She had uh, 600 ang na-charge natin. And nagpasok siya ng pillows at rugs. So medyo late na rin, 4pm. Oh. 4pm pa siya nakadating sa tindahan natin. So meaning... Throughout the day, parang... Ay, de, sorry, sorry. 4 p.m. on April 11 niya, kukunin new items. Okay, next one, si Francis, Mr. Francis. So, wash dry fold ito. Ito yung per kilo natin. So, 215 na charge natin sa kanya. So, thank you, sir. Kay Mom G. Ay, uh, no. And anyway, may minimum naman tayo when it comes to wash dry fold to 250 per person and yun yung minimum natin. Thank you Ma'am G. Si Ma'am Jill naman, wash dry fold, may blanket, may towels din siya. So total niya is 600 naman. Alright, si Miss JC. Alright, usually JC Mister, no? So ito okay ba? Miss JC 400. Comforter uh, beddings. Okay. Then the last customer for today, uh, Miss Leia. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, meron tayo dyan. Comforter, towels. So, five items. Sir, uh, medyo iba iba yung mga items. Pero, mapapansin nyo talaga for household yung uh, type ng customer selling. Kasi meron na number of uh, salima. Merong dalawang may comforter. What should I fold? So, ayan guys. So, 2,600. And then, meron tayong nabawas na expense. Actually, meron kaming ginagawa monthly basis na pinapacheck natin yung mga machines. So, thankful meron tayong natatawag na technician. To help us maintain the machines and yan. Uh, ito guys, meron sa report na yan. May nakita na lang may bawas dyan. So, 2,000 yung sales natin. Maganda rin dyan. Fully paid na rin tayo sa service natin. And within that day, meron tayo nakuha 2,600 less 400. So, for today, meron tayong uh, sinasabi nating gross profit na 2,200. Gross pa lang yan kasi wala pa yung ibang actual expenses. Later on, uh, by the end of the month, this end of April, try natin siya mababawas. Pero throughout the day, meron pa rin yung ibang other activities. Hindi lang naman yung mga tao nagdala ng damit. Meron ding nag-claim nag ng mga items sila. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 customers came by the store today so thank you guys for uh thank you ma'am sir yan mga ano natin customer natin for coming and 
supporting our business. In total, yan, tito, total naman, meron kaming 17.8 kilos for today. And meron din silang 35 people that they reach out to. Ito yung either tinext sila, tinawagan nila uh, through the phone, or minesis sila through the messaging app. Na try to do this, may marketing tayo every day. Hindi lang yung naghihintay tayo sa store na may papasok na customer, malay mo, walang pumuntang customer. Lalo na lalo na this coming holiday, maraming bakasyon, wala sa mga lugar nila, and busy, lahat outside of Manila. So, yun lang guys, I uh, just wanted to give you more concrete and actual idea ano ba nga ba yung sales sa isang laundry shop. And hopefully, uh, pinag-isipan ko ba't medyo mababa talaga yung sales dito. Uh, to be honest, uh, trying to figure out how I can grow the sales or how I can... Uh, improve pa on this store. So, hopefully, uh, you can be part of my journey. Hopefully, the next few videos, makita niyo tumataas din siya. So, <laughs> yun lang guys. And I hope you guys have a blessed Holy Week and see you guys next time.